New checks are being carried out on foster carers to protect children from sexual abuse. It's part of an action plan that's been announced by Nottingham City Council. Well, our social affairs correspondent Jeremy Ball is here. Uh, Jeremy, what's the background to these checks? Well, now, these were recommended by the Independent Inquiry into Child Sexual Abuse. Now, you'll remember that spent a month hearing some really harrowing evidence uh, about what happened in Nottinghamshire's care system, uh, abuse over several decades and how victims simply weren't believed. And a lot of that abuse took place at the old Beechwood children's homes. And there were terrible stories from other homes too, but some of the most disturbing cases involved children who were living in foster care. Now, these victims weren't identified, but we did hear their voices. And here's how one survivor gave evidence to last year's inquiry. We were robbed of our childhood, all of our human rights stripped and taken away, robbed of our true identity, robbed of being and feeling safe, secure. Instead, we can become vigilant, hypersensitive to the simplest of sounds, smells, the creak on the stairs, the turning of the key in the door, the ticking of the clock and knowing what is coming. I need you to understand the fear. So how are these new checks going to work? Well, Nottingham City Council says both current and former foster carers are now going to be assessed to see uh, whether they might pose a risk of abuse to children in their care. That's going to include carers from independent fostering agencies. And that's important because last year's inquiry heard that they simply weren't being monitored effectively. And this is just part of a wider action plan, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Uh, the council's also agreed to commission a, an independent review. That's into how it prevents child sexual abuse and also how it responds to it. It's pledging support, more support for survivors. And there's a commitment too to a personal apology to anyone who's been affected by this. Jeremy, thank you.